Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Kyla Ganton and here's the seafood news for the week of October 31st, 2016. <laughs> An unexpected closure in the Gulf of Alaska will leave many West Coast vendors scrambling for inventories of flatfish this fall. The National Marine Fisheries Service has prohibited directed fishing for ground fish by trawlers in the Gulf of Alaska as of October 22nd. Other than pollock and rockfish, trawlers will not be targeting important flatfish species to prevent exceeding the 2016 Pacific halibut bycatch limits. The news comes as a shock to many. We saw the same closure last year around this time, but it was not expected this season. The Bering Sea will remain open for ground fish at this point in time. The 2016 Pacific Cod total allowable catch for Pacific Cod in the Bering Sea is 239,000 metric tons, comparable to 72,000 in the Gulf of Alaska, which is now closed. Groundfish harvests from the Bering Sea are mainly shipped to Asia for further processing into twice frozen fillets and portions for North America. The closure in the Gulf will have a predominant impact on groundfish products available from Gulf processors. As of October 22nd, 38.4 thousand metric tons of Pacific cod had been caught in the Gulf of Alaska. In January, trawlers in the Gulf will fish pollock and cod and some boats will resume targeting flatfish. Expect new season cod and pollock fillets in Seattle around late February and March as production will begin in January and February. The market opened with first products available last March at $3.60 per pound for 8 to 16 ounce Shatterpack cod fillets in Seattle. Current pricing is now in the range of $3.65 to $3.85 per pound in Seattle for 2016 production, which will be short until the A season production arrives. Vendors who were relying on harvests of Rexol, Roxol, Flathead Sole, and Arrowtooth Flounder in the Gulf of Alaska will now have to rely on already established inventories. Arrowtooth flounder raw material is typically destined for China, but sole buyers might seek domestic options like place instead. Existing inventories of Rexol from the Gulf of Alaska were available at 75 cents per pound in Seattle this week for whole round block frozen 200 to 400 gram medium size Rexol. There will be no replacement product for this item, so buyers should think ahead for inventory needs as there will not be new production available until March. To wrap things up, our Tradex Live offer of the week is for 8 to 16 ounce Shatterpack Pacific Cod Fillets. These are number one quality skinless boneless with 6,000 pounds available in Seattle at $3.65 per pound. Click or tap the icon above to view this offer. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3 Minute Market Insight. This is Kyla Ganton. Buy smart and eat more seafood.